Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Project Zomboid Meeks 7 Days to Die. It's episode 7. We got a lot of work that we got done. We got a little bit of a platform here. We got some little uh, driveways for the vehicles. We picked up this trailer. We worked on a little bit of a border around the house as well as the farm is blossoming. Somebody left the gate open, of course. Uh, we moved some of this around. We forgot to pick up our grill, so we went and grabbed that. Um, the only thing we didn't move was the compost bin because it was full of stuff and I didn't want to lose any of it. All right, and then we head inside. We've got most of the armory is uh, coming along nicely. We've got a couple little decorations here and there. we got the ammo press as well. Uh, we found a school Jason mask and a couple other things. Uh, we put some vending machines inside. We got our stove working finally. We also expanded over here. We made a little pantry. I might even add a little door or something. Uh, we have all of our fish in these guys and all of our farming in these. And then this is just some extra stuff we picked up over the time. And then all of our cans are now in one spot instead of that little spot in the cubby in the corner. We finally got the sink working. For whatever reason, it just was really bugging out. I just kind of messed with it for a while. Um, had to like tear down the walls, put walls down. It was a whole fiasco, but I got it working, which is great. Um, we got one more plushie on the bed there. A little, um, I think what he is. Let's see what he is. An anteater? Uh, let's see. Molly the Mole. All right. And then the bathroom. Nothing really going on out here yet. Uh, we got all of our stuff in the duffel bag here. We picked up our Hellcat, which we're going to work on fixing up. Show you the skills here. We got a lot of them leveled up quite well. Um, I don't know really much about masonry, so I'm not sure if we're going to use that one at all. But uh, tailoring, we were doing a lot of... Ooh, somebody's coming in and out. Hey, Amber, what's up, man? Um, mechanics, we were leveling that guy up a lot. We got to find the book for tailoring. Actually, I might have it. Um, carpentry's been maxed out for a while. We got cooking leveled up and first aid. Uh, and then farming. Not first aid, I'm sorry. Farming is leveled up there as well. We do have to find the book for the tailoring. And then also I want to get electrical up a little bit more. We've got this guy plumbed up. Got our fishing bag here. Uh, got Katrina hanging out. I redid this a little bit. I think the goal is to mainly put some of them green crates down. I think they're military ones. And then maybe a shelf or two. I would like the look of these shelves. But unfortunately they're not really very like dense for storage. I got some propane tanks and stuff over here. All kinds of car parts. This guy right here is one of these cool mods. It's called Plus Storage. And you can make these little things. So it should be easy to make. And you can increase the storage for like things that like I don't really feel like making 80 bins for. I'm just going to throw it all in one. Um, and then we also got this guy put down for our fuel. We got almost a thousand fuel in there. And I think that's pretty much it so far. We basically dumped all the gas cans in there. Oh, we also got this really cool stalker outfit here. I'll take a look. Oh, it's as far as I can zoom in. But yeah, it's really good. It's good good strength, durability. Um, I got all the patches on it as well. So it's all decked out, ready to go. Uh, once I level up Taylor a little bit more, I'm going to redo all the patches because it gives you a little bit of a better better feat. A little extra defense. Uh, we did lose a couple of our team members again. They do not like to survive too well. So, Alright, so it's uh, the day 44. We have a hoarder in a few days. Not sure what I want to do yet. I definitely want to go adventuring for some guns and maybe there's military crates. So maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I will definitely going to have to sleep first. Maybe I'll grab one of these survivors here, deck them out, and we'll head out. All right, boys, let me show you where I'm thinking. Right down the road. It's actually not too far. Head out this way down here, down here, and right over here. There should be a gun shop. So I think we're going to head there. And next on our list is probably going to be up here somewhere. I think there is a crate warehouse or something like that maybe it's up here uh we'll probably need a lot of those supplies as well so we'll head to the gun shop see what's going on after that hopefully we get some goodies maybe we'll head up to that next spot pretty boys we're arriving here we got twiggies and the gun shop this could be pretty sweet only caveat is uh we are a little bit fatigued from all the exercising we've been doing uh, so we have to be careful with that we're gonna turn this on make sure we have some light and let's head on in boys Unbarricade this thing. Oh, it's even open. Look at that. All right. Now we have to take this out, but luckily we have a nice sledgehammer. Bang. There we go. It'd be cool if like an alarm went off every time. All right. Let's see what we got, boys. Glow sticks. It's interesting. I think that's from an authentic Z. Let's look that. Oh, we got some armor, some ammo. Sweet. Hex out with some kind of gear, a recoil pad, or a helmet. Nice. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Nice. Lots of ammo. 
Might even take some of these uh, lockers as well. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Nice. Oh, boys, look at all the goods. MP5, FAL, survival knife. Oh, I'm so glad we bought that uh, trailer. <laughs> we are going to be loaded. Tons and tons of loot, boys. Hell yeah. What else we got? Ooh, an Uzi. Ooh, a reinforced baseball bat. This kind of looks like an Egan's bat. Spaz 12. Sweet. Ooh, an Anaconda. That's pretty sweet. There's a lot of body armor, too. What's back here? Oh, it's just a bathroom. Okay. Have a sip out of the toilet. It's always good. We're about in here. We got some loots. Oh, yeah. A long sword. Shit. That's so cool. Lots of guns. All kinds of different parts. We'll take all that. Oh, yeah. All right, boys. I think we looted everything up. Nice. We got tons of guns. We have a lot of stuff to play around with. Ooh, a nice energy drink. A lot of stuff to play around with for the next ward. You can kid out some of the boys. Let's pop all this stuff in here real quick. Well, while we're here, we'll also check out Twiggies. See what they got going on. Probably some alcohol and stuff. Nobody here? Wow. I do want to take some of these stuff, though. Full table and uh, how much does this weigh? 40? Oh, only 20. Let's take all this stuff. Let's see if they got all the goodies in here. Ah, just a lot of books. That's a little bit odd. I guess we'll probably take some of them. We'll probably need them. Oh, looks like there's not a single drop of alcohol here. A lot of these bottles just for the decoration, but... Alright, boys, so sorry about the uh, weird-looking screen. I don't know why my Streamlabs just kind of got bug bugged out. Uh, but instead of going up there, I think we're actually going to head over here. There's a vehicle I left here, a gas station, and I think these are a storage spot and a, like, a little warehouse. So I think we'll head over here instead and uh, see what kind of good loot we can get. Hopefully good loot. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of Zs here, too. Is that... Oh, there's a bunny. <laughs> Oh yeah, that is a challenger right there. That's why I marked that. That's right. Uh, we got a little storage area and some uh, like unit storage units as well. So let's take a peek out here, see what we can find. Hi boys! Oh shit, that boy is fucking popping off. Well, that's one way to do it. Hopefully that gun will protect him. Gave him a gun that has a uh, 15 rounds, so he should hopefully have a little bit more leeway with that. But it doesn't look like the gun's very quiet. So let's have a couple shots. Got you, buddy. Got your back. Got to reload really why he's. Uh... Oh, yeah, here we come, boys. Oh, look at that bunny. That's so cool. Oh, here they come, boys. Get him. Get him. What are you doing? Don't let them bite you. Why is that not hitting him? There we go. Alright, reload again, boys. I don't know why that menu keeps popping up. Look, he's flapping them, boys. Holy shit. Anybody else in the area? Actually, let's turn this off. I forgot to extinguish that. At least our aiming is doing a lot better. Pistol whip, pistol whip. Here we go, boys. Make sure we pick up all of our... Ooh, there's a gun right there. Make sure we pick up all of our... Shells off the ground. There we go. Alright, while he is killing everybody, I'm gonna load this up. Uh-oh. What's he doing? Just standing there. Come on, come on, reload. I don't know why he's just standing there. Oh, come on, dude. No. Yeah, he just stood there. Why is he reloading? Oh, he's got some health too because all the armor. God damn it. Well, there goes another one of our boys. Whatever reason, they don't like to live. Ooh, this one's got another generator. I just popped on the car. We keep it, keep it on standby in case we need it. Well, I just needed the fence with the uh, generator in my hand. Wow, what a chat! We got another generator. Holy shit!
Another generator, boys. Holy shit. Baseball bat, needle thread, tennis rackets. Suit up all my survivors with tennis rackets. Tennis racket horde. Oh, another generator. Holy shit. I like dismantle it. Oh, look at this guy. He's cool looking. He's got a nice looking bag, too. What is that? I guess we're going to find out. It's like a military. Bring camo Alice pack 45. That's not as good as ours, but I wonder if we can upgrade it. Hazmat suit is pretty cool, too. It looks like he's just drawing all the uh, the zombies down. Oh, what's he got? Is it an axe? Over here, boys. I want to have some fun. Ooh. Use a crowbar a little bit. It should help with the maintenance skill as well. Yeah, nice. Oh, that's one of the newer looking ones, too. Yeah, I wonder what that helicopter's doing. If he's just shooting people or if he's just being a scum leading them all over the place or if he's dropping off loot again like the one time. Ooh, this guy's got a gun chilling. All right. Ooh, a bodyguard, 380. Let's see what we got going on in these vehicles. I don't think this one's uh, got anything to it left. I can dismantle it, though, for some uh, mechanic. Yeah, there we go. Or some, uh, not mechanic, metalworking skill. Oh, this one's still alive. Holy shit. Ooh, a gun case a flare gun oh that's sweet i didn't know they had the flare gun all right boys it's the next morning we got everything organized got our washer and dryer set up it's 4 20. um i do want to maybe do a little building for a little shed or something for all these barrels and generators that i have accumulated just grab a bunch of these planks we also upgraded this bag it's the same same uh capacity as the other one but just looks a little bit cooler uh, so we got that i think that's all we're gonna need i think yeah and we'll uh Set up like a little, little bit of a uh, shed or something. I'm thinking. Yeah, you got all these things here, these generators. I was thinking about putting it down here, but it's kind of far. I think maybe also putting it up here. Yeah, maybe I put it right over here. All right, boys, here they come. Let's get this guy lit up. We've made sure we fill it up as well before the horde. Got all the boys ready. Let's see. Here they come. Hopefully, I can get them aggroed on me, and these guys can just uh, take them out. Because I don't want them to end up getting us. Um, end up getting a little, a little bit of a brain fart there. Um, I don't want them to end up killing all of our guys again, like they usually do. So we have some over there. I want to see if maybe I can just train them around and then the, the people will take care of them for me. So let's uh, let's see if I can just get everyone's attention. So far, so good. Yeah, there we go. Now they're shooting. We just have to make sure we pay attention to any people that are coming in. And make sure they stay on us. Ooh, this guy, he's got some stuff on him. Ooh, this guy's got a ghillie suit. Ooh, two ghillie suits. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, boys. They're starting to pile up now. Come on, boys. Stay after me. Stay after me. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was close. Luckily, our uh, gear took that in. Oh, man. They're starting to, they're starting to flock, boys. I wasn't paying attention. They almost got me. Oh, you're looking at them all up here. Let's uh, get a shotgun out, maybe. Oh, no, they're going down, boys. Oh, man. I knew that was going to happen pretty quickly, but I didn't think it was going to be that fast. We're just going to have to uh, train him again. Oh, they're running. They're running, but I don't know if they're going to make it. You know, I think this might be time for the MP5. Oh, what the hell? Where'd that bitch come from? It's just a laceration, so it should be good. But I don't know where she came from. Maybe I ran right into her. I want to equip this in both hands. And I want to get these guys. Oh, look at them all. Holy shit. Yeah, 
Okay, they're all having snacks right here. All right, let's, let's hang out here and start uh, dropping them. Let them out, boys. Let them out. Oh my god, we're out of ammo already. I think I had a few mags for this, but not too many. Oh no. She's down. Let him out, boys. Let him out. And we have one mag left, maybe. Gun's actually not that bad. I don't know if I have any more magazines left. Yeah, I think we just have to load them in by hand. We'll just kind of train him around while we're doing that. Yeah. Dang, this mag goes fast. We need like a drum mag. How's your guy doing? Hopefully he's alright. Be able to sneak around here. Load up that mag. Do a little, uh, get a little distance between us and the zombies. And, uh, do some more popping. Ooh, at least we got another skill in aiming. How's our skills looking so far? Ah, uh, we got five aiming and three and a half in reloading. Ooh, look at this guy. He's kitted. Nice bag, too. I like that one. Maybe I'll replace my... Oh, that's like the desert one, I think. The only thing I like about mine is it's like grayed here, which looks really weird. Oh, yeah. Maybe I'll try the shotgun. The shotgun might have a little bit more damage because of the spread. What's going on over here, boys? These guys are like, oh, oh, Blart, you're still alive. Holy shit. Come on, Blart, let's take him out. Blart, keep running, boys. Get out of here. I don't like how, like, they're highlighted right in front of me, but they don't get shot. Oh, no. Yeah, they're Blart, come on. Come on, we're gonna make it. At least we had a bunch of shotgun shells this time. Blart, how you doing down there, bud? I don't know where he went. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's still shooting, boys. He's not going down without a fight. Oh, we got a couple more cycles and we should be done. Out of here, bitch. Oh, we got a lot of cra a lot of crawlers today. Come on, Blart, let's take him out. Blart, is that it? Did we did we survive? Just you and me. Holy shit! What a freaking horror night, boys. Look at the aftermath of that one.
I think that first, uh, maybe like it was like the third one. That one was really bad. This one wasn't horrible, but we did lose two guys. Blart survived. Blart, come here, buddy. Oh, he's okay. Sweet. All right, how are we looking? We're still bandaged. We're doing okay. Let's have a quick smoke break, and uh, that's going to end off the episode. It's almost 50 days so far, boys. We're doing pretty good. We lost a lot of people, but uh, for a good cause, we're making good sacrifices. Um, so, yeah, I think I might do some kind of little shootout area for them so they can kind of be protected. Maybe, like, um, make, like, a bullseye type of target and have them right in the middle and bullseye be the walls so they have to go through multiple walls to get to them. Um, hopefully something, I get them to work so they stop dying, but... If you enjoyed, definitely drop a like. I appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for the next episodes. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.